Meteorologist Cedric Haynes was also at the expo. He joins us now with the first look at the forecast. That's right, Lou. We had a great time out there. Really went over a lot of information and met a lot of nice people out there and really had a chance to talk about the upcoming hurricane season. Now, let's take a look at what's going on with our weather locally today. Nothing like that going on right now, which is some good news. In fact, we've got plenty of sunshine out there. That may be good news unless you're outside because if you're outside, you notice one thing we have. That's the heat and the humidity. Take a look at these temperatures into the mid-80s across the area. Some locations made into the upper 80s. Here over towards eastern Texas, you made it into the lower 90s. This is a dew point, and so this is a measure of how much moisture is in the atmosphere. Notice there in the 60s and lower 70s. That's very oppressive out there, and you add that moisture with the temperature, you get the heat index. And yeah, it's in the upper 80s, so yes, even low to mid 90s off to our west. And yes, it's that warm air will eventually make it this way. But this evening, we're going to stay on the muggy side. Temperatures slowly, and I mean slowly, falling through the 70s out there with, again, a few high clouds moving on into the area. The warm weather is here to stick around for a while. We do have a slight chance of seeing some rainfall with a weak disturbance moving toward the area. Lee. We're going to talk much more about that and we'll let you know about what you can expect for any outdoor plans in just a few minutes. All right. Thanks, Cedric. Mm -hmm. It was a big day 